Falling on your feet, do you finally see what you're missing? Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by and visiting today. I have and I'm very very excited for today's video because I'm going to share with you what I received in the Wengas mystery bag or mystery bundle deal. So a couple of weeks ago uh, Beautylish had put this on sale for the Black Friday and I believe they had three bags values. They had one for lips which was around 60, 75 dollars if I'm not wrong. Then the, the one that I have the medium one which is 105 US dollars and they also had a luxury mystery or bundle, uh, mystery bundle. I think that was around 200 dollars. So I sit with this one and I said not only I'm uh, going the medium one because it will be too expensive for me with taxes. This retails for $105 but with taxes, VAT, VAT European duties, I ended up purchasing uh, 127 US dollars and free shipping of course. And I said that it is similar as a price with the Charlotte Tilbury, the mystery box they also put for the Black Friday, Black Friday um, deal. So, also I know they have, or, or at least they had, I don't know, uh, an ongoing fight. So, and even though I don't believe that two adult people should solve their personal issues through social media, I said at least let's do fun and have a battle between those, their mystery boxes. So you already know what I received in the Charlotte Tilbury. I'm going to link that video down below. I thought it's fun to see who is able to give us a better deal. Wingas or Charlotte Tilbury. Now, spoiler alert, I know what is inside and also the value is around 220 US dollars. Let's see what are the products inside. So, first of all, I'm going to show you a sneak peek. There are a lot of products. And look, I got my samples. Finally, Beautylish started to include the samples. I think on my past four orders, I did not receive any samples. And I was uh, a bit upset because they are throwing a good size. Usually they put a general size of samples. So they had a offer with the purchase. I believe if you're shopping and buying Wayne Gas products over 70 dollars or so you were giving one um, gloss for free so i don't know which one is this i have two sh high shine glosses the high shine gloss so i have one in the shade antique rose and one in the shade chrysanthemum all right so this is the chrysanthemum it's a nice like a bronzy shade it's more suitable for summer or for more rich complexion and the other one we have is the antique rose oh all right so it's the same kind of a deal i don't see much of a difference between those two shades besides the fact that this is a little bit more darker and they also have shimmer and by the way i have another gloss from wayne gas that i received last year in the or this year in the Beautylish goodie bag and this is this and I like this color more because it's creamy. I think it has just a slight shimmer. So yeah, I would have preferred to have something with more rose or peachy tint to it, but those are also nice. So probably I will uh, save them for upcoming giveaways because I'm not so much uh, of a gloss person. But each of those glosses retails for 22 US dollars. And then we have the lipstick. One lipstick, so this is the Luxury Cream Lipstick in the shade Peach. So judging for the color, I think they made it to match with the lip glosses. But let's see, let's see the color in person. All right, beautiful packaging. I do have other two lipsticks from Wengas. Oh yeah, all right, this is this. And it's indeed, it's a beautiful, I think I'm going to keep this. Yeah, it's a beautiful brownish type of the shade, which is matching perfectly with um, 
those lip glosses and I do have from him also this is the Magnolia and the one that I'm wearing today I have on the Carnation today from Winga so those are the existing one and this is the new one that I got so he has only neutral color but you can tell that this is more brownish the one that I got so and then oh my god you guys I have five liners now I have uh, looked at the packaging three of them are lip liners and two of them are eyeliners so I'm very very excited about them so I'm going to start with the lip pencils sorry this is eyeliner three lip pencils I have the shades medium nude natural berry and cinnamon okay let's see them now in person and I also have one Wayne Gas lip pencil which by the way it's in the shade natural berry oh okay we have a dupe so I'm going to set it for giveaway I love the formula all right this is the medium nude okay so they are going to work perfect with the lipstick so you have to sharpen them those are not mechanical liners but I like to sharpen my lip and eye pencils and I know that makeup artists like Wayne Gas and not only they do prefer that and it's more hygienic it's so difficult when they all have the same packaging sorry for my voice guys I am uh, going through a cold which was on and off for a few days oh my god so the next shade it's the cinnamon and it's a rich brown but with red tints this is this the cinnamon and the natural berry I'm going to swatch mine so yeah it's the same you can tell I didn't use so much of course natural berry it's more of the kind of the shade that I'm wearing for my lips let's recap we have three lip liners we have the medium nude the cinnamon and the natural berry and those are these medium nude cinnamon and natural berry and for the eyeliners so one of them is the rich hazel I can tell this is more a dark brown it looks like being black but when you swatch it it is brown this is the tiger's eye it's even more brownish those are the liners and I believe uh, he mentioned that uh, they last also on the waterline <clears throat> and the last thing that I'm going to show or the last things that I'm going to show you are the face palette and the eyeshadow palette and if I didn't mention both the lip and the eyeliners retail for 14 US dollar each all right this is the weightless veil blush palette in the shade sweat sweet wildflower I'm not going to show this packaging because it's too shiny and it's competing with my ring light and with my lighting and by the way guys I am very excited because I finally have natural light it was snowing we have a beautiful snow outside and of course with the snow you know that the light is there I absolutely love the packaging as I told you I open it and actually I was struggling to open this one and even now I need some help so this is the face palette you have a neutral blush and we know that Wayne is obsessed about the size of the product that you are getting in uh, packaging so he went very very ham and generous on making those pan very large so yeah absolutely beautiful I'm going to insert swatches because I don't want to have too many swatches on my hand it doesn't look so neat from my point of view when I'm uh, presenting a video and I love that they packed everything on bubble wrap and this is the luxury eye palette in amber yeah the only thing that uh, is about this packaging is that you can tell the fingerprints right away this was more easy to open oh my god look at this guys I don't know if Tracy has it but she told me that 
Wayne Gas Shadows are just outstanding. So I love that we have a rich shade here that you can use to deepen up your look. And this is winter or summer or any time of year appropriate. So I'm very excited about this and I'm happy to be able to try his formula. And I love that I didn't get the most neutral one, so I have more color to work with. So I'm happy that I have a sparkle of color. Maybe I can just swatch this. Oh, wow. This is so beautiful. So happy about this. All right, and there we have it. This is the Wayne Gas Mystery Bag or Mystery Bundle or whatever you name it that was available on Beautylish. Those are limited edition, but they do bring them like a few times per year. And it, it was my first time when I got it. And because I do not own too many Wayne Gas products, I thought for me, this was a hit. And now coming back to the uh, Charlotte Tilbury mystery box, we only had six and some of the products were like unusable, for example, the lip tint. So between those two boxes, I think we have a clear winner and the winner is Wayne Gas. I don't have the box here, but I can definitely tell you that Wayne Gas mystery bundle is the winner. Not only for the value, I do believe the values are similar. Maybe just we have a slight deeper value on, uh, higher value on the Wayne Gas. I'm going to make a total up for the Charlotte Tilbury and I'll put it on the screen because I didn't manage to do that prior recording. But we got way more products from Wayne Gas and everything was well thought together. We have a face palette, eyeshadow palette, lip liner, lipstick, lip gloss, eyeliner. So you have products for a complete full face without base and mascara and of course brows but I just love it and as I told you if you don't have enough Wayne Gas product in your stuff I think this is a great way to get to know Wayne Gas brand so yeah Wayne Gas is the winner but I hope you enjoyed this video guys and by the way if you are wondering what I have on my eyes I am wearing the Pat McGrath the Midnight Voyage eyeshadow palette I will come close to you. And for the foundation, I was very happy to grab my Fenty Beauty the primer and to see they are working so well together. The soft matte long wear, long wear foundation. I do recall using this foundation on uh, summer and I thought it is a little bit too dry and mattifying for me. But I think with this primer it works amazingly. I know this is an old foundation, but I got it last year on Boxy Charm and I do want to use as much as I can out of it. And my jewelry, this is not a collaboration video, but I'm wearing my Ana Luisa necklaces, which I absolutely love them. And I also have her Cody ring and the other ring and the earrings are from the Moon's Wish, the pearl company that was sending me those products in PR a while ago. So I just wanted to let you know in case that you are interested, I will link everything down below in my description box. So yeah, I'm going to have another haul. I wait for the Look Fantastic bundle to receive the winter bundle. I post about that in my community section. And if I'm getting it today, I might move that video uh, a bit sooner because it's still available on uh, Look Fantastic website. So I think it's an amazing deal. And I do have another haul from Cult Beauty and a collab video. And I think that's it for the 2020. I need to take a break because I have been uh, like working nonstop for my channel for the past couple of months. And I do feel the need to rest and take care a bit of my personal life. So yeah, this is my schedule for the end of 2022 and I'm going to come back in 2023 with probably my first videos will be the best of 2022. So yeah, there is that. Long story short, I don't want to make this video too long. So let me know what do you think was the better box, the Wayne Gas or the Charlotte Tilbury. I would really love to hear that from you. And also let me know what was the favorite product out of this box. For me probably it was the eyeshadow palette. But I love everything I got and I'm happy that I'm able to play with more Wayne Gas products. So yeah guys, I want to wish you all a beautiful Advent season. Enjoy this magic time of the year. And for those of you who celebrate Christmas, I want to wish you all Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Thank you for taking the time to watch and I'm going to see you soon with another video. 
Bye. <clears throat> bye bye.